All right, I'm back again, and there's a fucking Jason on the loose. He just killed every motherfucker in this damn cabin and busted out this door. But you know what? We got to do things the Jarvis way. Stupid fucking idiots and walk outside. Everything's quiet. Nice and peaceful, but don't be fooled. When's that ever fucking good in a Friday the 13th movie? What you want to do now is you want to come over here. <clears throat> We're going to unlock this cabin. I'm going to go and get a shovel. I don't really think there's much more we can interact with in this room, so we need to come back out and continue on down the path. Look, y'all bitches need to get the fuck out of here. You didn't see that motherfucking psychopath bust out of that cabin right back there? Or if you did, or you're too stoned and you're just chilling by the fire. But anyway, this is Adam. He's the counselor that I use in online mode the most. I'm going to let y'all read this real quick. If I stop too fast, you guys can just have to pause it when you get the playback. Like I said, motherfuckers are stoned. That bitch is all rocked back in the goddamn lawn chair, and his eyes are redder than fucking Satan's himself. Alright, moving on though. There's a car over here. We might be able to get the fuck up out of here. Okay, nope. Not having that copyright shit. Hey, Rob, let's stop and uh, fuck with the radio while we're trying to skip a fucking killer with a bunch of stone motherfuckers oblivious that there's a killer on the loose. can't leave. Oh, isn't that convenient? A refrigerator with a padlock. Oh boy. Well, we can either look around for the combination or we can <clears throat> do the combination because I've played this part before just so you guys know how to get through it and, and, and I have to bring up a good point here who the fuck padlocks a refrigerator but you want five three one two Five, three, one, two. Thank you. Okay. All right. Of course. Oh my. Oh my. Come home to mommy, Jason. You know oh. the way. Well, it sounds like it's going to set us on our path. You guys are still fucking sitting here. What the hell? And you too! You should know better. You were killed before.
Oh, this is that motherfucker's shack, man. I don't know about all this. I feel like I'm setting myself up for some kind of failure. Alright, well, obviously... Mom Duke's head goes in here. Apparently, it's patch hunting time. Well, let's take it and keep on rolling. Don't ask me why. But having that shovel just leaves me to believe there's only one reason for us to be here. Yeah, I'll take a snapshot of that. Might find a use for it next Halloween. Oh, wow. Apparently, we gotta dig Jason up. Or fuck, would anybody wanna do that? But, uh,. Before we, <laughs> before we do. Let's see what this shit has to say. Well, because the game tells me to. <laughs> well, hello there. Ain't you a peach? Well, time to be even further idiots and recreate the scene of Friday the 13th, Part 6, the opening. This is a highlighted piece of rod. Let's go ahead and pick this up, shall we? Well, we're patch hunting for some reason, and it involves this damn grave. Alright, boy. Killing us! Oh, he's an ugly bastard too. Ugly bastard. I need a dentist and, a, and a, a dermatologist, maybe a chiropractor. Whew. 
After that, I need a coffee and a tea and a lay down. Oh look, another patch! No shit he lives. And if you want to answer which version of Jason should be canon, I hardcore believe Kane Hodder should be, and I think I'm not alone in that one. So we're going to go ahead and take this patch. And off to the next spectacular patch. Which I'm also sure is going to be full of nice jump scares. Now, if I remember correctly, this is going to work as like a proverbial maze. I think if I remember, like I said, the idea is to walk in the straightest, most path possible. That just happened. Okay, so let's try this again. Yep, went too far. <laughs> See, this sucks. I don't remember where to go. <laughs> yep, wrong way again.
Okay. <laughs> figure another mound of dirt oh what the fuck is that oh it's the dog what brings us back out here all right Told you all motherfuckers you needed to run. No. for real this time. Alright, we got this gas. these invisible holes would generate and if you manage to fall through one you'd end up in this weird untextured area of the map it was not like an area we physically created but um, like made of bits of our assets eventually you'd be shot up high into the air and killed by Jason in the sky luckily we were able to get it out before cert but it was a tough one how were you able to find it we had this debug code that would show us the holes in the map that helped us hunt them down what was the debug code you know, it's the same code everyone uses when they need to input a secret code in a video game. I mean, just remember back when we were kids. It's probably better for legal that way. <laughs> uh, I can think of one code. That, that, that might come into play a little later, though. Alright, out of here! Hey, I've seen this before. Well, we completed the virtual cavern again. But just like Jason, it will come back. And so I, as soon as I get caught up with everything, and uh, we will continue with the virtual cabin. Just keep that code in mind. Oh shit, what up?